Bang! Needs Knives. I'm Jared, and you guys know what time it is. We have a concept unboxing. I have not looked at any of these. All I did was pull them out of the original box, and we got... Let's just pull it out. We got four knives here. I love Concepts packaging. They do a great job with their packaging. This is the Bevy. It is a slip joint. Oh man, that is some smooth. Jack, I bet you I can do that one handed. Yeah. Very smooth. We have 154 cm. This one is the Jade G10, which means you can make it whatever color you want. And if you've never writ dyed anything before, it is unbelievably easy. It is, it is so easy. Um, I don't know why. A lot more people don't do it. It's that easy. I mean, you just boil some water, put the writ dye in, make sure it's like synthetic and, uh, you know, pick the color you want. But, but yeah, it makes it to where you can, you know, customize colors, make whatever colors you want. And this is a really cool clip point blade. Great size. You know, it is a slip joint. So, you know, you do have to be careful, but yeah, great little clip point because you got plenty of access to that tip. Nice, good belly beautiful blade shape beautiful stone wash i love concept stone washing very nice good steel too so okay now this one is similar to the first one but it's a back locking version oh look at that carbon fiber that's some nice carbon fiber just from the first look at it i don't see any voids but the texture and just the way it plays with the light, you see how it's got the side cut section right there. Very nice. And then you got the flat section there. Very, very nice. Very smooth. So same thing as the, the last one, but this one is a locking version. Let's see if we can, I wonder, I just want to feel it first. Okay. So I, I bet, I, I don't know. Maybe in the future or, or after I review it, I might be able to do it like that. I just did it like that. So obviously I'm going to be able to. The nail nick, it, it's very smooth. And again, beautiful uh, stone washing, 154 cm. This is awesome. Let's feel that lock up. Rock solid. Extremely solid. Wow. Way more solid than <laughs> I would have thought, you know, and it's got the steel liners. So... You know, it, and it does have some weight relieving in there, but it looks still rather strong for such a little user. This is nice. No clip though. So you're going to want to get a slippy or fifth pocket it or, you know, whatever. No lanyard hole, which, you know, no need, but it is going to be one that's drop in the pocket or drop, you know, on a slippy on your hip, fifth pocket knife, something like that. Very, very awesome. Okay. These next two, I'm pretty excited about. Let me just say, pretty excited about. Oh, yeah. So, this is the Stellar Titanium Frame Lock. That looks like it's going to be a good clip. We'll see. Degnan Design. Nice, nice action. Very nice action. Wow, that is really cool. Let's check the centering. Nice centering. Flipper tab is uh, a light switch. Because uh, I guess you can kind of push button, but it's mostly light switch. Definitely going to break in very smooth after a couple days or after a day just depending on how see it's already it's already breaking in even smoother than the first couple flips let's check out the lockup so we have internal stop pins where is it though oh i, I see the track okay so it's got the track internal stop pins great detent especially for this flipper tab because the type of flipper tab it has if you look you know, it's so much higher than the pivot, which means you're going to get a great amount of leverage. Now, um, let's feel 
Okay, so putting my finger on the lock bar did not hinder it at all. Did not at all. So even when I put my finger right on top, very nice. Very, very nice. No, um, what's it called? Death lock. No death lock. Nice jimping. It does keep you kind of farther back from the blade in this grip, but you always have the ability to take advantage of getting right up close and just use the the middle finger to not slip up the blade that's the way i do it so i just grip like this and then use this you know the forward finger to go right around that choil area or you know flipper tab area very nice and then i can see getting in this grip right there it's going to be very nice check the geometry pretty decent yeah, that's thinner than I would have thought. Holy cow, that's nice. Man, look at that stone washing. Isn't that a beautiful stone washing? And let's check that detent really quick. Okay, the detent is nice and early because you're going to have to, because you got the flipper tab that's so close to your finger, but it's it's nice and early. So you don't have to worry about hitting it. And it's not like fall shut action yet, but I can tell it is going to smoothen out. I was going to try to flick it, but I can't. <laughs> very, very nice. And I love this plain stone washing. They do have other versions of this or colors. So that is not the only one. Oh, that clip. I just slipped it in the pouch and it slipped in so good that I can already tell. Great great clip that is awesome very very awesome all right next one now i'll be honest this is the one <clears throat> that i'm i, I want to say i'm most excited about and i know it's because of the name so i don't want to be biased or anything like that because you know even like the degnan design i love degnan designs and you know i love what's coming out of here we have, and it's also the name kind of too. I like the name. We have the Concept Convict by Sheepdog. Now, let's let's just take a quick look at it. Look at all them studs. Man. Oh, wow. I didn't realize the clip is another color. That is cool. Looks like it's a good clip too. We'll see how that works out. Now, if you can see the one little thing that... I don't know. I'm not going to say it's an issue yet, but the one thing that I, I'm a little concerned about, but we'll see nothing on this side. We only have, wow, that worked. What? What? That is so smooth. Holy cow. Wow. And it is so easy to use. I'll say this right, right off the bat. This is, and it's not about the smoothness. It's not about the smoothness. It's about all the other little details, the lock bar, how it feels, the and the smoothness, but the detent, the lock up, um, the lock bar, the the texture. This thing feels high end. It does. It really does. The ergos are beautiful. Really good ergos. I like that I can get up nice and close to the blade. What we'll kind of steel S35? Super smooth action. And this, I know you just seen me skip off of it, but it's very easy. It's very grippy. So you can get it up in the front like this right there, or you can go up underneath right there. It doesn't really matter because it's grippy in all the ways you want to do it. Now, the one problem is, is that's the only deployment. And it's not that it's a problem and you can easily slow roll it. If you're left-handed, let's see. Uh, you might have to put your finger on the, I'm, eh. Let's, yeah, you can get it. Um, uh, remember I'm not left-handed by the way, so you can get it, but you do have to hold your finger a little low, but it's not hard. You just gotta get that positioning now for let's, oh, never mind. There is another way to deploy this knife. You can flick like that all you do is just put tension bang so you can thumb flick and i know that's not conventional and some people aren't very good at that all i'm doing guys is putting my finger pressed up against and i'm using 
the contact on the side, not in just one place from here to here is pushing contact. So it has a big contact area and it, it's, it's very easy once you get used to it. I mean, extremely easy, great texture. I just want to check this clip really quick. I'm going to check it on its own uh, thing. Cause I'm wearing jogging pants right now. Nice, very, very nice. Good tension. I like that, that strong tension too. Ooh, that was my fault. Very, very nice. Wow. Gold pivot, that's cool. The only thing is though, I wonder, because there are different versions of this too. They have a blue one, a baby blue one that I really liked at that, that looked really good. But you see the, the pivot, and then you have the backspacers. I almost wonder if it would have been cool to do the 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 screws here. Um, the thumb stud, or whatever you call this thing. I don't know what we would call that, but it looks very cool. Matches the clip. And that lock bar feels so smooth right here. It's so easy to get to, even though it's not cut out this direction. It's very easy to get to, and it's very comfortable. Very nice. So there you guys go. The review will be coming. Nice edge. Let's check the geometry. Pretty decent. Look at that. So we will be testing this thing out and reviewing it. And so the review will be coming soon. I love you guys. Thank you guys for watching. Peace.